Attention! Although my content is usually family-friendly and suitable for all ages, Phoenix Wright Justice for All is a game that has been rated T by the ESRB content rating system, and as such, the videos in this Let's Play may contain blood, mild violence, and or suggestive themes. So, viewer discretion is advised. Well, welcome back to Phoenix Wright Justice for All, everybody! We are gonna finish up the Case 2 second investigation period today, and I'll be honest, I really don't remember what comes next. Which, how? <laughs> I mean, we've got a girl on the run and Cyclox to break. I, I remember that. I don't. There's more to this case, but I don't really remember what. There's like a. I'm pretty sure a big thing that I'm forgetting. All right. All right. June 21st, Crane Village. Cool. I think I found everything I can. Oh, did I stop it to like right at the end? That's not good. But I can't see how they all add up. Hmm. <laughs> And this eeny miny being here just a coincidence? Hey, hey, mister. How is it that the spirit Dr. Gray wanted to call just happened to be that nurse? And that nurse turns out to be Eeny's sister? It's too convenient. Hey, hey Phoenix, I'm talking to you. I wish Wait, I knew a little more about Eeny, but where am I going it's to find info else. like that? Oh, I get it. You all can't be bothered to look at trash like me, is that it, Mr. High Mighty? Ah! Bada! Oh, so you finally noticed! I thought I heard a mosquito buzzing in my ear, although I couldn't understand a word. <laughs> wow, Phoenix! <laughs> well, I gotta hand it to you, you sure know how to chase down garbage! I mean, I'm grateful to you for chasing this large lump of one around like this. Um, thanks? But, you know, you're just wasting your time. I'll be fine on my own. Well, what are you going on about? And as for following or chasing or whatever it is, isn't that what you're doing? Uh, well, you see... Well, you're not exactly a real gentleman with a lady's heart, are you? You're not exactly the world's number one charmer either, sister. Do -do 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 Look, I'm really dang sorry about today. When I get all fired up about something, it's impossible to stop me. You hurt Maya really badly, Lotta. Um... I don't suppose you could forgive a gal like me? Forgive her? Don't forgive her. Wow. What are you gonna do, Artie? <laughs> I mean, I know the Bible preaches forgiveness, and I obviously will forgive her, but I have to know what happens oh if God. we don't. I'm not done. Um... And to think we trusted you, Lada. And what did you do? You stabbed us in the back! You stressed us all out, and you even gave Maya a few strands of white hair. Now I'm going to have to pray she makes it or she might come back as a ghost. Ah! That's enough! You can stop right there! Look, I'll tell you everything I know. Everything, I'll spill it all. Everything? Yeah, you got it. Everything. But, well, actually, tell you what. I'll even do it for free. Oh, okay, this is where it all meets up. All right, interesting. You can choose not to have her and it's still free as Well, I guess you did help Maya out too, after all. For real? Yeah, for real. Ah, oh, thank goodness. I'm still... I'm still... what? No, no, nothing. Nothing at all. Just talking to myself, you know, gibberish. Now then, lot of heart at your service. Mm. I'll share with you all of the dirt I've dig up. D thanks. That I've dig up. Hey, don't be all surprised. Tell you what, I'll even give you all this info for free. Mata not taking money? Now I know this one's an alien clone. Well, you still need to pay for that bill. If Maya's not the real murderer, then... Who do you think is Lada? Well, heck, ain't it obvious it's that occult freak? You mean Eeny Miney? Well, there ain't anyone else that could be, right? That granny, you and me, we were all together the whole time. So Lada suspects Eeny. Which means she might have already found some info about mysterious Eeny. Hey. Check it out, Lada. <laughs> Nope! Don't know nothing about that! Things that don't catch my eye don't catch my interest! And she calls herself a journalist. Oh. Nope, so, nope, oh, nope, man. nope. Hey, Lotta, how did you hide in here? Nope, 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 nope. Fuck on it, Lotta. You think I could have the guts to carry one of these around? Celebrity photographer with a gun? You think it'd work? Bang, bang! Nah. Thanks, but nah, I can't see myself like that. <laughs> ah! There's, there's blood on it! Get that away from me! What is, where'd you get showing off something like this 
to me. Oops, just that was the wrong thing to show her. I'm a real natural, aren't I? I was waiting for her to say something like that. <laughs> I got the murder just right, even managed to make it mysterious. Mysterious? All you managed to do was forget to focus your lens. Shut up! That's my technique! My technique now, you hear? <laughs> your technique of not zooming in and focusing your photography. About this clipping. Now, you listen here, boy, and listen good. You can't go looking at such an old piece of paper, you hear? People's got eyes on the front side, you know why? So they can see the front of themselves, not behind! So how about it? You feeling my energy? Nope, not an electron. <laughs> you know, I'm beginning to get sick of this hairstyle. Next time I go to the salon, I'm gonna get my hair straightened, I reckon. What do you think, Phoenix? I think if you got rid of your afro, I wouldn't recognize who you were. Yeah, that's kind of the problem, ain't it? Please, can we get on with the important stuff? Say, like, the murderer. <laughs> Wait, show her... yeah. Nope. <laughs> show her... Hey! This is that prosecutor gal! The one that likes breaking all the rules! Switches are for the horses and lights, not people. How's that? I made a pretty clever pun, didn't I? Sorry, I didn't hear you. Ugh, well, I'll forgive you the wax in your ears this once and tell it to you one more time. <laughs> um, can we not? I swear, I've seen his face before. Maybe during that last case. Whenever something happens, this detective guy's always there. I wonder if he's the real baddie behind everything. Somehow, I highly doubt it. Now, this kid, I think she needs to be taught some manners. This here's her second time in the stew, right? My pa would have slapped me straight! Y yeah You know what they say, if there's a second time, there's bound to be a third, and a fo- OW! <laughs> uh, you didn't have to slap me, I get it, I get it, sorry! <laughs> Why'd you scream I thought Phoenix was gonna be- Hey, stop it! <laughs> I thought so too, but nope. Oh wait, whoops, <laughs> we already Wow, wowsy zowsy. Uh, that, yeah. Hey, it's that Dr. Gray guy. It's a pity what happened to him. Not really. Pretty scary what ghosts and ghouls can do to a man, huh? God rest his poor soul. Hmm, since when was Wada so religious? I don't know. I feel like Southerners just say that, like, well, bless your heart. Yeah. Hmm, I overlooked this little kid. W what do you mean? I mean, I didn't think it, but... You know how it's always them silent types? <laughs> huh? Wait, wait, wait! The little type's nothing but a ball of happy goodness, right? So I reckon she's the type to have done it. Well, now, that's just how the world turns. I don't think this has anything to do with how the world turns. Sure, Morgan, yeah. That old lady sure can be forceful. She scared me that day. Well, only a little now, you hear? How about Eeny Miny and, yeah. Nope. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we need to present Eeny. Heh, <laughs> that's Eeny Miny, right? Yeah, I was wondering if you know anything about this girl. You know, actually I did a little checking up on her the other day. But the murder was yesterday, how did she do that? <laughs> that's uh, weird. Yeah, plot hole maybe? <laughs> her sister, she's the one that Dr. Gray wanted to call back to the, the spirit world. Yeah, too I had heard as much. I'd also heard that Eeny was the one to introduce Dr. Gray to Korean Village. You don't say. That's one sneaky gal, if you ask me. Hey! Want me to tell you more about her? Yes, please. We need info to break her psych locks. Speaking of Eeny, do you have any other information about her? Sure. Well, what is it? <laughs> it'll cost you, and it'll cost a lot. Of course it will. Oh, silly me. Here I thought free meant no money necessary. <laughs> that girl was hospitalized about half a year ago. Jeez. <gasps> oh! How did I forget about this part of the case? <laughs> How'd you forget? Oh, I'm gonna have fun. <laughs> You're, you'll see. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's, no, let's just keep going. Wait, okay, now I remember everything. <laughs> okay, okay. Hospitalized, but why? Maybe her brain? Maybe half her brain's gone, and that's why she's like, Whoo! 
I don't know. Okay, that's Marty's fury. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe she got hit by the car. Oh, her how did I this. forget about this part? I don't know. I well, blocked, heck, you I can go it. find her out on her own. <laughs> I probably blocked it out of my memory. That's how. Huh? Here, I'll give you the clinic's address. Maybe you can find out something. Maybe? What's that supposed to mean? Well, see, actually, it was going to be annoying, I reckon, so I didn't actually go there. Ah. Well, that's the way the gumbo spoils, right? Spoiled gumbo sounds... Ew. I mean, look, don't blame this on... Oh, never mind! Looks like I don't have much of a choice. Better go check out this hottie clinic. <laughs> How did I forget about the hottie clinic? Oh, Let's go. I'm super excited. Man. This is either going to be terrible or hilarious. Oh. Well, this looks like a normal... June 21st, hottie clinic reception. Oh, oh boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> So, this is where Eni was hospitalized. Yes, are you here to visit a patient? Oh my gosh! <laughs> I totally forgot about this He's guy! Mrs. There, is, T? there is another uh, male character for me to voice. Ah, yes. Are you a doctor here? Yes, I'm Director Hardy. Oh, oh. Ah! I didn't think I'd be speaking with the director himself. Yes, so uh, what can I help you with? <laughs> I'd like to ask you a few questions about Miss Eni Miney. <laughs> Miss Miney, Miss Eeny Miney, <laughs> yes, <laughs> oh, her, ah, it's too bad, I'll tell you something, that girl left a long time ago. Here you are, sir. You know you shouldn't be up and about, come on, it's back to the room with you. Ah, uh, Sweetums, calm down, calm down, don't be so harsh on an old man like me. Don't you dare start that Sweetums thing on me. If you don't behave, you'll get yourself tossed out of this hospital. Wow, I didn't think nurses could be this director forceful towards their boss. Come now, be a good boy and give me the director's white lab coat. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. Mm, yes. Um... Hmm, yes, uh -huh. Don't, hmm, yes me. Who in the world are you? I'm Director Hardy. Ho <laughs> ho. The nurse went off somewhere. Oh, the inhumanity. Only person I can talk to is this guy. Ugh. This guy's weird, but is oh. he wearing a shirt? <laughs> yes, he is. I couldn't tell. It just looks... It's just, it's the skin-colored shirt. It just looks like he's wearing a belt and a shirt. Oh, actually, hang on. I need to check something. <laughs> How old is this freak? Director Hadi purported. We don't know. A peculiar patient who claims to be Director Hadi seems to be extremely healthy. <laughs> oh, maybe it's not him then. Okay. Yeah. Well, the nurse just said, like, give me back the director's lab coat. So he's literally just pretending to be oh. the director. So he's uh, just a crazy patient. So what exactly do you treat at this clinic? Hmm, yes, we treat all sorts of doctory clinical stuff. <laughs> yes. Is this guy high on like, stuff? Doctory clinical stuff? No, he's just weird. Well, I don't actually know particularly care about the details. Ho <laughs> ho. <laughs> yes, what does that look for? Uh, uh, yes, there's a really big general hospital around the corner. <laughs> yes. This is like salmonella. <laughs> when they can't accommodate everyone, they move some of their patients here. <laughs> you do surgeries here, right? Mm, yes, we do some plastic surgery here, it seems. Yeah, it is similar to the Salmonella voice. Just plastic surgery? It seems? Why was he mm, Yes, uh, it seems that way. This is an emergency. I need plastic surgery stats. <laughs> what, do you, here. <laughs> what do you know about Miss Eeny Miney? No, you're talking. Mm, yes, that girl. She was transferred from the general hospital. Oh, oh okay. Um, when I played this when I was 12, I didn't realize how overtly creepy this guy was. Holy cow. <laughs> well, you were 12, so that's probably part of it. Yep. From the general hospital to here? What kind of surgery did she need? <laughs> yes, well, she needed surgery. It was really bad. Really bad. So what kind was it? Mm, yes, well, no, no. You see, there is something. No, I can't tell you. Well, at least it was patient's doctor. So you say with a happy smile on your face, Mr. Director. See, there's this thing about how doctors aren't allowed to talk about patient stuff. It's all in those TV shows too, right? You've seen them, right? Hmm, yes. I'm never going to get him to unzip those broken zipper teeth of his at this rate. There's gotta be something I can show to this old coup. Newspaper clippings? I do love this music, though. This patient is undergoing rehabilitation. 
and look at the strange face twisting in all those ways, and that oily sweat. Mm. His whole body is swaying back and forth, wobble wobble, like he's about to fall. Mm, yes. Hey, don't just cut into my monologue like that. I'm explaining things here. <laughs> uh, sorry. Mm, yes. No. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> Oh, this guy's weird. Uh, yeah. He might be everyone's least favorite character in the series. <laughs> this is the clinic's reception desk, but it doesn't look like there's anyone at the counter. On the wall is this month's word to the wise. Do something in vain, and your only reward is tiredness. Hmm, not exactly the best thing to be telling your patients, is it? This guy is literally, like, the stalker that no one wants. Is there a stalker that people no, do want? No, <laughs> but, like, just the dude where you're like, why are you here? Why are you hanging yeah. around me? This must be the waiting area. It's got the feeling of one, and there are sofas lined up. But I don't see all that many patients. Hmm, <laughs> yes, well, it's the quality, not quantity, that counts. <laughs> what in the world did that have to do with anything? <laughs> oh. Well, if this is the same clinic as... Whatever. This is not Gray's Clinic. Oh, it's not. No. I was about to say, I'm like, well, the director's dead, so that might be why. No. Did, oh, I wonder if they know. What if they're like, oh, hey, uh, has anybody seen Dr. Gray today? No, nope, I think is... he's still gone. Oh, at his clinic? At his clinic. Oh. <laughs> I wonder. I, I hope they know. I wonder where that doorway down there leads to. Oh, that's the x-ray room. <laughs> yes. Uh, how did you know what I was thinking? <laughs> yes, well, it's a... That's because that's the x-ray room. <laughs> yes. There is something very peculiar about this guy. Because I know it's not me. Yes, well, alas. This is the clinic's reception desk, but it doesn't look like there's anyone at the counter. On the walls this month... Oh, we already did this. Whoops, my bad. Well, let's talk. Art present. So you said the clipping? Um, so what do you know about this? I see this and uh, my mind's blank. Hmm, yes, it's boring. Then that's why. Boring. Hmm, yes. How do I put it if you have more, hmm, more attractive items? Yes. Attractive? Huh? Uh, you, nothing's more attractive than my attorney's badge. <laughs> that's actually what we have to present him, believe it or not. <laughs> really? We've never had to do that. We did for the old man at the noodle shop. Oh, we did. That's right. Hmm, what's this? I'm a lawyer. Right now I'm investigating a murder. Hmm, hmm, yes. What is it with your angry face? Violence isn't the answer, hmm, yes. The trial is tomorrow, and I would really like some information from you. Hmm, is that right? Well, you know, I think I can let you in on a little secret. What's that? Hmm, yes, actually, I'm not the real director. Are you kidding? Anyone with half a fly's brain knew that! What do you mean? Do I have to explain this to him? Well, hold on. I'll give you something. Real information, okay? I'm actually this clinic's... See, I'm like this place's walking dictionpedia. You mean walking encyclopedia? Y yeah, that. And my specialty is in young, silky smooth, hotty patients. There's nothing I don't know about them, but I get embarrassed talking about it. Yeah. How about you keep that kind of information to yourself? Ho <laughs> ho Anyway, you wanted to know about Miss Eeny Miney, right? Well, yeah, she's hot, so. Miss Eeny Miney? That girl, oh, I remember her especially well. Really especially very well. Great. Uh, <laughs> this guy's so creepy. So I'd like to ask you about this person. Hmm, Sophie tells me, hmm, yes, um, no, nothing. There's no need to bring that person in for an exam. Wouldn't do it anyway. <laughs> Even as a pretend doctor, he gets an F from me. Uh, ask him that. The obvious. No. So about this girl. Hmm, <laughs> she is, um, not the best. <laughs> yes. But she'd be a great candidate for surgery. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, for plastic surgery? <laughs> That's really the only thing I can prescribe for her. What is he talking about? What surgery? You don't want to know, Phoenix. <laughs> Would you please take a look at this person? Oh, this is, this is a superb example of a woman. <laughs> I'd like to meet her just one time. Bring her to me tomorrow. She'll get special attention from me. <gasps> How did this make it into the game? How did I not pick up on any of this? <laughs> no! <laughs> Where How did you get this? This is a medical facility. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember. 
I'm really afraid to show her Pearl. So, about this girl, isn't she the patient down in room 206? Hmm, yes. I'm sure that cute nurse is taking very good care of her. That nurse said the girl has chicken pox. Or was it measles? Maybe the flu? Um, Pearl's is fine and well, although I feel sorry for the nurse now. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's <laughs> like, uh, no. <laughs> Missy me is really cute in this picture. You'd agree, right? Y yeah, sure. I wish I could see her again. Maybe the next time she has a big accident. <laughs> yes. I'll, I'll tell her for you. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I'll be waiting for her. <laughs> yes, waiting. Yeah, now you can see why people hate this guy. <laughs> he is a terrible human being. <laughs> okay, Queenie. About this person. <laughs> I feel like... I feel like somewhere... I've seen her somewhere before, I think. <laughs> well, when she comes tomorrow for a consultation, I'm sure we can get reacquainted. I don't believe... I can't believe they haven't kicked him out. <laughs> okay, Alana, you're next. No, nope. <laughs> he's like, oh, I think she's a dude. <laughs> this person, ooh, she's nice. That look in her eye, she looks like a queen. I mean, she does. She's glaring at me. <laughs> ah, her stare is making me choke up in tears. I, I was whipped by her, and it hurt a lot. Oh wow, I'm so jealous! So, did you cry? How did it feel? I cried a little, I think. I can't actually remember. Oh, it's me, mm, yes. My tuft of hair, it's so nice. Shows off my smartness. You should try it too, my new hairstyle that I invented. Ah, uh, that's okay, I'll pass on this one. Alright, let's let's just get this. Over Why didn't we show the uh There's he would not say oh, okay. anything about that. Please tell me what you know about Eeny Miney. Hmm, yes, I'll get to that. Trust me I will. That girl, she's right. She was transferred from here from the general hospital. This was, hmm, yes, a year ago, one of those emergency cases. What was she ill with? Ill? Nah nah nah. She was injured, not ill. With my trained eye, I could see. Yep, I could see it was a large wound at that. A huge injury? Her whole body was wrapped around and round in bandages and her arm was in a cast. That sounds pretty severe, all right. <clears throat> yes, it was an accident. An accident. They're scary, yes. Cars. Mm, yes. Car? You mean it was a traffic accident? Yep, that's what she gave her the terrible injuries. I swore it was in the papers. Hmm. <laughs> yes, I looked it all up, I did. It was terrible. Hmm, <laughs> yes. Dare I even ask what is wrong with this old guy? <laughs> so much. The operation? Why are we- oh man. Just now, you mentioned something about a big operation. Hmm? <laughs> are you talking about Miss Eenie's operation? Y yes Miss Eenie's. That- ah, that was one heck of an accident. Mm, yes, her whole face was burned like bad toast. It was bad, very bad. Um, oh, only a year has passed, and that looks pretty good now. Yeah, was it really that bad? Mm, it was a good thing that Miss Eenie had a picture of herself. I heard that picture was how they put her face back together. Mm. Picture? That girl, she uh, had, uh, she had just gotten her license. So she just happened to have a license photo on her. Mm, yes. Oh. So, see, I got her picture as a way to remember no! her ass. Well, more like swiped. You took her driver's license? Um, breach of ethics? Oh, wait. What? What? A pretty girl like her. I bet she has lots of pictures of herself. Um, sure. It's a treasure. My treasure. Precious. Ugh. What happened to the actual license itself? Who knows? I didn't bother to ask. It probably got burned up along with the car. Hmm, yes. License photo added to the corridor. We now have two profiles of her! Great. Just to make it even more confusing. Um, so you looked up information on Eenie's accident, correct? Yep, sure did. Mm, yes, I read every paper that covered it at the time. What kind of accident was it, do you remember? <gasps> yes, hold on, I'll go get it for you. The article, I mean. H huh? Y you have it? Well, 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 don't get me wrong. I thought something like this might come up, so... Why? Obsessive to the max, but I bet I can learn about how to stay on a lead from this guy. Uh, here we go, here we go, <laughs> yes. According to this, Miss Eni was in the passenger seat. The passenger seat, huh? Must have been driving with her sister. And dozing, or so it says. 
A strong Joe would hook her up, and the next minute, a sea of fire was all around her. Miss Eni fought with the door, finally got it open, and somehow managed to get away. Anywho, you can read all about well, the details makes, in this that makes article. Sense, though, because yes. the opening thing, there was like a car, and there was the person like, uh, on the outside of the car, so that might have been her. Yeah. Newspaper clipping 2 added to the court record. Well, updated. A new clue! It's a clue! <laughs> I should Final. probably look this over. Goodbye. Newspaper clipping 2 articles about the car accident. Highway of Nightmares. May 24th, late last night, two women's car crashed into a highway center divide. One of the women was not able to escape from the flaming wreckage and died at the site. Ongoing investigation has revealed that the driver had fallen asleep at the wheel. Miss Eenie Miney holds interview about crash. I was like really tired and I dropped off to sleep. Then there was this crash and I like, I woke up in this huge sea of flames. I was like still half asleep but I opened the right door and like got out. I like don't remember anything else. Doctor working in the shadows? If Miss Eenie Miney's to be believed, the one driving the car was her sister Mimi Miney. Mimi Miney was the nurse at Gray Surgical Clinic where 14 patients were accidentally overdosed to their death. Is it then just a mere coincidence? That's like a terrible newspaper right there. But honestly, more informative than some newspapers I've seen. Mm -hmm. Also, as creepy as this guy is, he's probably the most helpful witness in the entire he is. case. Because he didn't. His entire. He's so obsessed with re things relating <laughs> to this case. Yeah, that's true. It's been half a year since Miss Eni had her surgery and got better. She was discharged something in dis sometime in December last year. It's already been half a year, huh? Yes, so, how was I? I was a real help, wasn't I? <laughs> yes. Y yes, thank you very much. <laughs> yes, well then, I'll be getting back to my room then. Please tell Miss Missini I said hi, okay? <laughs> yes. It's time for me to leave too, <laughs> yes. Ah, okay, I bet it's definitely time to leave. <laughs> what? <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye forever. forever. <laughs>